come to life by accident when you are Hey everybody, bit change of pace for this week because things are changed and planned differently now. Um, Friday uh, well, might, might be something special, so I wanted to make sure I could still get in a dose of Persona this week without completely depriving you all of some extra sharp edge. Uh, or not, because my... okay. Well, that's alarming. My saved games! The fuck? Um... <laughs> Hold on. I have one guess for how this happened. I can fix it. I can fix it! Let's see. Um... Different account. My, my best guess would be I'm on the wrong profile. Ignore the black screen. It's fine. Everything's fine. How do I sign out of this account? I don't know. Go. Oh, oh my gosh. What a great start to the stream, eh, guys? I don't want to. Oh my gosh. There we go. Jeez. Okay, so now if I click this. Okay, try this account. Yeah, no, the problem is the account I signed up for to the Xbox portal isn't the one that's connected to my Steam account, so sometimes I get their wires crossed. Yeah, yeah. I already did this intro. Come on. There we go. Okay. Whew. That could have been bad. All right. June has started. I don't know how else to prelude this. <laughs> We learned Akihiko has issues. Alright, who's available to do stuff today? Pretty much everyone. Um, what's going on in the student council?
Come on. Auto. I don't see Odagiri. Is he absent today? Um, no. I'm pretty sure he came to school today. Then where is he? Probably busy playing detective asshole. Ah, so this is what Fushimi was telling me about. I see. Well, his intentions are good, so you can't really blame him. But I understand how you feel. Ah, oh, uh, you're all free to leave now. Good work today. Did you hear me? I want to see evidence, smart guy. I don't need evidence. I already know everything about. Oh no! Like what are you how doing? You were arrested for beating up that guy in the park who snitched on you, right? Whoa! He's still at it. <laughs> this is the third time today. My boyfriend was so pissed after he was accused. This guy's really asking for it. Keeping quiet will only make things worse for you. If it's really not you, then give me some names. And don't worry. I see I we have a blooming you. fascist you here. Word as a member of the disciplinary committee. Better fuck off, asshole. All right, hold on. Can I hear that one more time? One more take. Better fuck off, asshole. Better fuck off, asshole. I like how he does the fuck off. Like a nice little exclamation point in the middle of the sentence there. Better fuck off, asshole. Uh, let's see here. Do I want to save him from his own mistakes? No. God, what a shitty day. Hey, knife. Nice hook. Don't think I'll just let you get away with that. Oh, hey. What is it? Did you need something from me? It looks like you're hard at work. <laughs> you bet I am. If we turn a blind eye here, there's no stopping this from happening again. I don't know. If he aimed a bit higher, you would have gotten a black eye there. And once it spirals out of control, there will be nothing we can do. We should nip this problem in the bud while we still can. I know what people think of me. Then again, those who fight for justice have always butted heads with others. History speaks for itself. Oh boy. Oh boy. Loaded topic there. So let my actions serve as a warning to other offenders. A sensible person like you should understand. If you've right? done nothing wrong, you have nothing to fear. Yeah, trust me to turn you into the police. And I don't mean turn into as in call the cops on him. Trust me to turn you into a cop. Starting to see why this is the Emperor! I'm going to keep at it for now. You should head home before it gets dark. I headed home, but it got dark. Still avoiding the Akihiko chair, I hey, see. Yikitaki. You ever check out the student message boards and stuff? You know how last week that girl was found by the front gate? Well, now, they're saying it was an angry spirit from this one ghost story that did it. Come on, nobody really believes that stuff, right? What's this ghost story about? What? It's probably made up. We don't need to go into details, do we? I'm interested. Go on, tell us. Mm. You got it. Here goes. <laughs> <laughs> Good evening, and welcome to Junpei's Believe It or Don't. You know, uh, what I don't believe is that you were able to actually dim the lights in here. There are many strange things in this world. Legend has it. Late at night, after everyone has gone home, a maniacal ghost roams the halls and devours anyone caught in its grasp. The other day, this friend of mine, let's call him Witness A. Anyway, 
He said to me, Hey, Iori. I saw something weird the other day. He sounded so serious. So I asked him what he'd seen. He told me he saw the girl from 2E and claims he watched her go into the school on the night before the incident. I told him I don't believe it. Not even for a second. That girl from 2E ain't the type to go wandering around at night. But witness A was as white as a sheet. He swore to me it was true. Then it hit me. If the girl was found unconscious at school, then maybe the ghost really did make her its dinner. It all made sense. She went to the school at night and walked right into its deadly trap. I felt a chill run down my spine, and I broke into a cold sweat. Yes, there truly are some strange things in this world. Believe it or don't. I know what Naruto thinks. What do you think, Akihiko? Seriously? Not one word about my amazing performance just now? It was a performance. I'm not so don't, interested don't in the jump ghost part. Of but it does sound like it's worth investigating. So, you're afraid of ghosts, huh, Yukata? Didn't know you were such a chicken. What? Who are you calling a chicken? Fine then. Let's investigate it. Each of us will ask around for the rest of the week and gather information. This ghost story is just a bunch of nonsense. I'll show you. Sounds good to me. The story is a bit unnerving, isn't it? Huh? Well, leave it to you guys then. Would have been too scary for me. What? Oh, Harnick, I I did find the uh, I did find the TV. I wish it wasn't hidden by the initial camera angle, but I found it. How do I want to spend the thing? Video games it is. Oh, Max the Minion, thank you for the five gift subs. One of them, I think, going to my mother. <laughs> For those of you who don't know why my mother would have any connection to this channel, she she helped out with the charity drive last year. I'll make sure she thanks you, but she's working right now. The dark hour is just happening. Good evening. Bitch, I'm sleeping. I'm back, just as I promised. How have you been? Get out of here. That's not very nice. Come on, don't be so mean. In another week, the moon will be full again. The next ordeal will be upon you. Be careful. Until next time. Morning. Did you say that before you took your exams, or are you pointedly saying it after? Good luck! Whatever. Hey, listen.
So, in this section... Monos Samichiko. Susama. Still trying to learn some Japanese, so I'm getting it in where I can. Oh boy, I can already tell what prompt's about to pop up now. My academics are too far behind. Stay awake. Yes, precisely. anything from that, but oh well. Let's go talk to Baby. Shot it, whatever. Sew it, knit it, and finally weave it together. I know I probably already said this in an earlier stream, but I do really appreciate that all the social link cuts are now voiced instead of just being like the first one and the last one for Persona 5 Royal. Today our work is done. Vinny, say, could we go to the tea shop, Azuki Arai, together? It will be my first time going. Will you maybe, uh, how do you say, show me the ropes? We can stop sewing? Sure, let's go. Oh, you are my hero, Katasha Kanai. It also helps because, honestly, at the music they have for the social link backgrounds, I hate. I really hate this right now. Because I'm not hearing jump around now. I'm hearing brown chicken, brown cow. Dakota, let's be off then. We'll go together, my Tomodachi. Mm. The Azuki desserts here are amazing. Red bean is so oishi. I love the culture of Nihon. Japan is sugoi. Amazing. Uh, sure. Yes, you understand. Japanese culture is number one. Ichiban! I am so happy I came here. 
Also, baby, is a good source of some elementary Japanese. And become Japanese. Oh, okay. Thank you for joining me today. I won't forget your kindness. I have an aunt who lives back home. She has been helping me. I have to tell her that I've made a wonderful new Tamodachi. Maybe seems really grateful. Enough that you overlook his weakness. Oh, look at the time! But I wanted to ask you more about Nihon. I must dream a bit longer, I suppose. We'll continue our Japanese adventure another time. See you later! I almost want to go back and listen to what they did with Baby in Japanese. Like, is it just broken? Very much seems like they're trying to do a still learning Japanese deal. But I don't think that translates very well because you just have him inserting Japanese phrases in an English sentence. I've got shoes! to get everyone's shoes. Sharp Edge don't give a fuck! No. You're right, I'm lying. I'm not doing it a little. I'm not doing it at all. Baby still wants to do stuff. So I do have a question for people who are further in the game than I am. Do Twilight Fragments ever, like, come back to where you find them? Or do you always have to go to someplace different? It's like, I know there's one that spawned over here and I already picked it up. I would assume they don't come back. So then I will show it. We should take a break for now. You have gotten much better at this. Tsubarashi, wonderful. I can do better. Ooh, so humble. I want to solve black you. leather. Kanshin. By the way, I have a question for you. I would like to make something Japanese, but what? 
Knowing you, Kimono. Maybe you caught up. Kimono! Yes! It has to be a kimono! But, uh, kimonos are very hard to make. I don't really know where to start. And the material is not exactly affordable. Hmm. I have to think about it. But I appreciate the advice. You are the only one I can talk to here in this country. As long as I have you, I will be okay. Daijoubu. I must make my way home now. See you later. Oh, welcome. To Hi, bye. Even have to go up the stairs. Ah, it feels all lied to. It increases my radiance! Oh, I'm leveling everything up today. I'm a tough, smooth, above average, sharp edge devil man. Yeah, that's what they said about the pork ramen, is that it was the collagen and the broth that like made your skin smooth. Do I buy it? No. I mean, I buy the ramen, but not the reasoning. Who even is the... What kind of do we have here? Consider. What kind of persona do you desire? This persona, yes. What do you wish to inherit? Mm. 
It seems you have been blessed. <laughs> Why, this is exciting, isn't it? Close your eyes. Ow! Last time you did that, did no favors to me. This power might be too much for you. It is a special persona you desire, is it not? Kinda. Accidents yet? Not that I've seen. I haven't fused many personas though, honestly. Nope. Uh, honestly, I like the that music more than I like this music here. Thank you so much. Who's not even good at math? Doesn't that sound pathetic? I never even wanted this job. Someone else entered me into the running. I didn't think I would actually get elected, though. But it was between me and a Barbie doll. Oh, uh, but I don't regret joining the student council or anything. If I hadn't joined, then I wouldn't have met such kind people like you or the president. Shut up. You're distracting us. Oh, I, I, I'm sorry. If you're gonna flirt with each other, go do it outside. I'm so tired of this. I can't even pick up my pencil anymore. They saw right through her. But if you give me a kiss, maybe I can study for another 30 minutes. What are you going on about now? Come on, you gotta take this seriously. Don't you want us to go to the same college? Just give me a kiss, please. All right, fine. They're really gonna kiss? Do they not know where they are? They have no shame. That's right, I agree. This is supposed to be a place of learning. And they're still just kids. So I say this, as a member of the student council. That kind of inappropriate behavior should not be tolerated at school. We should notify the student council president right away and discuss this at our next meeting. Oh great, we have a fascist and a snitch on the council. I mean, I agree. If you're on my side, then I have nothing to fear. <gasps> I'm sorry. I shouldn't be raising my voice in the library. I don't mind if I get in trouble, but I don't want you to get criticized, too. Oh, I didn't notice the time. It's smooch um, o'clock! I think I'm going to be stuck here for a while, so... You don't need to wait for me. Okay, bye. I left. Oh, it's you. Oh, okay. Thanks, game. I didn't forget about you.
pain. What? I haven't asked people a damn thing about that, and I don't care. Oh, today's Friday. Did you two ask around like we agreed? Ha! <laughs> no. Huh? Were we supposed to do something by today? I told you. I know, I know. I'm kidding. Man, we've got such a short temper. Fine. Then we'll meet in the lounge after school. Fine. Don't forget. Yes, ma'am. Nope, changed my mind. I just remembered I spent that one. Welcome to the Velvet Room. So you'll be summoning this one? May it be your inner strength. Are you finished? We look for... Okay, now it's up, you creep. Miss Kano's first name. Anyway, I already don't like this. Really popular with the guys, and I kind of took her away from them, you know? Like she became my girl before they even had a chance. Turns out Emiri's a really strict teacher when it comes to grades. At home, though, she's a real sweetheart. I love how her attitude changes when she's with me. Yeah, good looking people just flock together, you know? It's like a law of attraction. Sorry, I disassociated there for a sec. Uh, uh, okay. I know, right? It's like we're actually in a TV show. Anyway, what about you? Make any progress with Takeba-san? I feel guilty hogging all the happiness, so I'm gonna wish for you to be happy, too. 
And hey, don't tell anyone about me and Emiri, okay? Because teachers aren't allowed to date students. I wonder I why. I you because I trust you. Uh-huh. Shoot, look at the time. I'm way behind on my favorite show. Well, I guess that's because real life is way better than any show right now. Yikes. Okay, as we agreed on Monday, we'll now hold a meeting to discuss what we've learned. Wow, you're really into this. Of course I am. I got lots of good info. And it turns out there was no angry ghost involved. Oh, so that's what's important, huh? First off, let's talk about how this rumor got started. The girl was found on the school grounds, so it does match the ghost story on that point. But why did the rumor spread so fast if this was the first time anything happened? Because there were three victims. I was surprised when I found out. After that first incident, the exact same thing happened to two other students. All three victims had to be hospitalized. No wonder people thought it was a ghost. Okay, moving on. The victims were all in different classes. And at first glance, they don't seem to be connected. But they did have one thing in common. Anyone know what it was? What is this? A quiz show? Do you know? What did all three victims have in common? Well, that's obvious, but I would assume this. Yep, that's right. Not just once or twice, either. They all got in with a bad crowd and were always out late. They're Considering they all bitches. ended up the same way, it can't just be a coincidence. So, to find out what happened, we're gonna do some field research. What? Field research? No! Yep. There's one place where all three victims were regulars. Whoa, hang on. You're not talking about that spot behind Port Island Station, are you? With the cat? Oh, you know about it? Dude, you can't go there. I've heard all kinds of nasty rumors about that place. Oh, really? Well, then all the more reason we should go together. You're coming with, right? I don't care. I'll take that as a yes, then. Damn it! Oh, man. I don't know about this. That place is seriously bad news. Do we really have to go there? Up until now, all we've done is follow orders. Isn't it about time we start thinking for ourselves? I know what you mean, but... Man, you have to say it like that. I guess I don't have a choice, do I? Then it's settled. We'll go tomorrow night, so plan accordingly. Oh, maybe... Yeah, right. What? What even is this? Oh! Oh, thanks! Big hell! Get the same thing from a vending machine. I wanna plant my buff potatoes.
another full moon. I still think this is a bad idea. How are you scared of ghosts, but totally fine with this? Cause stuff you can't see is way creepier. Actually, I'm more worried about the things I can't see. Like bats. And knives. <laughs> Big deal. So it's a little dangerous. Come on, let's strike while the iron's hot. Strike? For you. Oh, now I'm the leader. I mean, technically, she is. She went first. Those rags, they're from Gecko High. Oh man, this is even worse than I thought. You must have taken a wrong turn. Cause this place ain't for you, buddy. Uh, well, uh, bye. What I'm saying is, you being here was ruining our vibe. Beat it, goatee. Goatee? Oh, you <laughs> mean me? We don't need your permission to be here. Hey, are you nuts? Read the room, won't you? I can read just fine. Come on, don't be intimidated by these punks. Is the library open? What'd you just say? She just called us punks. Come on, let's post some pictures that'll make her daddy cry. Hope you've been practicing your sexy poses. <laughs> oh boy, that's too good. These guys are scum. Oh, so now we're scum, huh? Man, I feel sorry for you, goatee. This bitch is a real pain in the ass, isn't she? Everyone pull out your evokers. <laughs> enough they didn't know what they were getting into i'll make sure they leave you good with that it's guy from other day are, dumbass they're not walking out of this you want some too it'll be fine Ugh, shit son of a bitch you just crossed the line you think you're going home alive now should we find out uh no, maybe not. <laughs> oh, man, what a loser. Bastard. Your name's Aragaki, right? Yeah, now I remember. Shinjiro Aragaki. 
You're from Gecko High too, aren't you? Damn it, you're gonna regret this! Oh man, Senpai! That was awesome! I remember you. You guys were in Aki's room at the hospital. You idiots. Go home. You don't belong here. Wait! It'll be fine. Sorry, but there's something we need to know before we leave. I'm about to write another check that Junpei's Did ass is gonna have to, to cry. Cash. Fuck. No. <laughs> well, what do you want to know? Is this about that ghost story? Yes, that's right. How'd you know? The rumor's been going around. Those girls who wound up in the hospital were here talking shit every night. They'd brag about all the stuff they did to some girl named Yamagishi. Yamagishi? <laughs> you mean Fuka Yamagishi from 2E? They were picking on her? That's why people are saying it's Yamagishi's ghost that did it. Yamagishi-san's ghost? Wait, what do you mean by that? You guys don't know? This Yamagishi girl might be dead. I heard she hasn't been home in over a week. Wait, what? I thought she was just out recovering. So, you mean she's still missing? So much for that ghost story. Mr. Akota is the homeroom teacher for 2E, right? Does he know about this? I get it, Aki. Still trying to make up for the past. Hmm. It's you who can't let go. Huh? Nothing. Anyways, it's all I know. We done here? Yeah, totally. Thanks a lot. Come on. Show some appreciation. <laughs> Arigato tokazaimasu. I didn't do nothing. Thank you for helping us. And for sharing what you know. That was really nice of you. Huh? Oh, uh, It'll be sorry. Fine. Just don't come here again. Next time we'll bring our guns. <sighs> Is that what you call it? So, uh uh. Give me a break. All right, hey, guy that rips me off every Sunday. I have want to talk to you. Uh, uh, uh. You'll get in trouble. <laughs> well, you seem trustworthy. After spending 20,000 yen, I could use a burger. How long to the 
this mascot stand there? Where's my money? I'm going to do it. Good, good. Not bad, kid. Mm. Thanks. Bye bye. Warning accepted. Oh, hello. Everyone's got cool casual outfits. Senpai, why are you here? Same reason you are. Mr. Ikoda, I'm here to ask you about a student named Fuka Yamagishi. No! Please, I... I never thought it'd turn out this way. Fuka... Hey, I remember you. What did you do to Yamagishi? Hold on, Kiri Jokun. This isn't an interrogation. Stop scaring her. Oriyama, you don't have to say anything if you don't want to. You but you should to say give her something. the wrong idea. Fuka. Oh, Lenny Patora, thank you for the raid. She always looks so Welcome to a missing person's case. That's when I realized she may be a model student, but deep down she's just like us. And because of that. I knew exactly oh, and Distortion Devil, thank push. you for the 17 month reset. I was messing with her earlier that day, too. It was May 29th. We took Fuka to the gym and locked the door from the outside. Wait, what? 
what? You trapped her inside? That's not funny. <laughs> that night, Maki got worried Fuka might commit suicide, so she went back to the school by herself, but she never came back. And the next morning, she was found lying outside the front gate. I went to the gym to let Fuka out, but the door was still locked. So I opened it and went inside, but she wasn't there. We all freaked out. Starting that night, we went out looking for her. But every night, another one of us wouldn't come back. And then they all ended up like Maki. I see. Mr. Okoda, all this time you've been reporting Yamagishi is absent due to illness. But the truth of the matter is that she was missing. You had to have known this. Explain yourself. I was thinking of the students, of course. Also, I'm an Children adult and you're a third year. I do not have to, to explain consider myself the future to you. Of everyone affected. So you chose not to report a missing child for the good of the class and not because you didn't want the police involved. It, it was in her best interest. I wouldn't want her records to be stained by something like this. Her parents agreed. Her par- She's non-existent at the moment. Um, why would her parents be okay with this? So to protect your career, you ignored your responsibility as a teacher. Despicable. Oh. Despi- Callous no, hair flip. I, I didn't mean, uh, I, I was just- That's enough. You can go now. We'll handle the rest. W wait but- don't worry. This won't be the last you'll hear of this. Oh, snap. <laughs> the fandom may wish they could do that. About your friends. Did you notice anything unusual about them before they went missing? Anything at all? <sighs> a voice. A creepy voice. They all mentioned it right before they went missing. They said they could hear it, calling their name. Oh, man. Senpai, could it be? It's them, no doubt about it. Up until now, we've never been able to predict who exactly would become aware during the dark hour. This voice must be the key. In other words, it doesn't just happen randomly. They actually get drawn in. I realize now, after seeing all of this, they're clearly targeting humans. Shadows are most definitely the enemy of mankind. Stay at our dorm tonight. That should be the safest place. If you hear the voice, tell us immediately. And don't leave your room no matter what happens. If you can manage that, you should be fine. Don't worry. Yamagishi should be all right as well. Fuka. Yeah? Iori and Takeba too. We'll meet after school in the student council room to discuss tonight's operation. Tonight? Yes. We are going to rescue Fuka Yamagishi. My guess is right. She's still inside the school. Understood. Good. You're all here. Tonight, we're infiltrating the campus. Our objective is to rescue Fuka Yamagishi. Uh, I don't get it. Are you saying Yamagishi is inside the school somewhere? And why are we doing this at night? At midnight, this place turns into... Exactly. That's how Yamagishi wandered into Tartarus. Wait! You mean Yamagishi-san's been over there ever since she got locked in the gym? That's right. But that was ten days ago! No matter how you look at it, she's gotta be... Don't lose hope just yet. Tartarus only appears during the dark hour. So where does it go for the rest of the day? Nobody knows. That's a good point. This is just a theory. But I think time flows differently in Tartarus. So even though it's been 10 days for us, it could have only been 10 hours for her. There's a chance she's still alive. Okay, all that grinding I did in Tartarus then must mean months have passed. Wow, you think so? But wait, isn't the dark hour pretty brutal though? Even for us, 
How could she last ten days worth in there? That is true. And even if she is still alive, we might not be able to get to her. Are you just gonna abandon her then? Maybe. I have an idea. Let's try to enter Tartarus the same way Yamagishi did. We'll go to the gym and wait for midnight. That'll be the quickest way. Is that really gonna work? In all honesty, I can't say I fully agree with this. If something goes wrong, you could all end up lost in Tartarus too. But... I'm not just gonna stand here and do nothing. If there's a chance we can save her, I'd never forgive myself. If you guys aren't with me, then I'm going in on my own. Senpai? All right, we know it's risky, but we also can't just leave her there. Right, and we won't know until we, we try. We can, but we shouldn't. Guess we're sneaking into the school then. <laughs> in that case, I've got just the thing. You do? Put your tuxedo back on, Junpei. No answer. This is a problem. I can't get a hold of the chairman. Well, that's not a big deal, right? There is one issue. Without the chairman's help, I'm not sure how we can get inside the school. No need to worry. I've got it all set. All set? Unexplosive? All right, I'll let you handle this. There's no time to waste. Let's go. An actual explosive? Uh, no. Uh, all I did was unlock a door. See? We got in no problem. Man, I'm a genius. Boom. Is there really something to brag about here? Yeah, honestly, school security must be pretty so lax. You it earlier. Très bien. We oui, good job. We should find somewhere to get ourselves ready. Your classroom should work, right? Why not the gym? Uh, what? Trey Ben? Is that French? Or something? Why are they talking in different languages anyway? Did you say that in English or Japanese? Can we turn on the lights? Aww, you scared? No, I'm not. Stupé. Hey, that's uncalled for. Quiet. We need to get started. It's better for us if the lights are off. They cut the power at night anyway. These cheapskates. I don't really like sneaking around. First, we have to find the key to the gym. It should be in either the faculty office or the janitor's room. You three check the faculty office. Akihiko and I will take the janitor's room. After that, we'll meet in the main hallway on the first floor. Understood? Fine. So, we're searching the faculty office, huh? Hey! Maybe we'll find some test questions. <laughs> Maybe I should go to the faculty office too. It sounds interesting. You're not planning to do something unethical under my supervision, are you? I suppose you'll need to be executed. Hey, come on! Obviously I was joking! <laughs> All I meant by interesting was that there's a higher chance of finding the key there. Enough with the excuses. Let's head to the janitor's room. Yori, you're coming with us. All right, let's get this over with. Threesome in the closet while two of us search the whole school. Great plan. Yank. something what there's someone else here we gotta hide great hiding <sighs> it was just a security guard Ooh. Uh, of course 
course I don't. We already know it's not a ghost. And besides, I'm not that afraid of... <laughs> M my phone! Why now? Put it on vibrate. And of course, it's just spam. I mean, that would freak most people out, right? Come on, the thing just rang out of nowhere. Ha. Uh. I'm a chicken. Happy? No. No. It's so dark, I can barely read these. Use your phone. What does it say on this one? <clears throat> Morgue. What? Are you trying to scare me or something? Yes. You better watch out. What goes around comes around, buddy. Wait a minute. This is the key to the gym. Okay, let's go. We're supposed to meet up with everyone in the main hallway. That was the janitor's did you find room. The key? Sure did. You know, I heard a scream that sounded kind of familiar. Huh? Wait, you actually did? I was just kidding. You want to take this outside? Guys, come on. All right, we'll divide into teams again. Three of you will enter Tartarus, and one of you will remain outside with me. Once the dark hour begins, I'll pinpoint Yamagishi's position. I'm going in. You come too. You can take the lead as usual. Fine. Send Mara, uh, thank you for the 67 month resub. Wait a second, Yukatai. Remember how I accidentally screwed up on the monorail? Give me a chance to make up for that. Oh, come on. It's not always about you. Besides, you didn't accidentally screw up. All right, Junpei, we'll give you another shot. And with that, the teams are set. Hooray, Team Sexism! Sweet. Thanks. What? What's wrong, Takeba? Do you have a problem staying with Mitsuru? Uh, no, no. It's fine. It's almost time. Let's go. Why didn't you go to sleep? No. No, I don't want to hear this! Calling me. I... I have to go to school. Tell her I'm sorry. Fuka. First time this lady's ever gone to school of her own volition. So... We still haven't heard back from them. Transmission ranges at max, too. Uh, I hope that girl Moriyama is okay at the dorm. Unfortunately, no place is completely safe in the dark hour, but we couldn't risk bringing her here. And having one of us stay behind to watch her wasn't an option either. Yeah, I guess so. We are all here for Yamagishi-san's sake. Hello. can you help me? I'm here. I've confirmed your position. You're higher up than I expected. You're barely in communication range. Is everyone all right? I don't know. Got separated. Akihiko! Come in, Akihiko! Uh, is he out of range? That's worrying. Fuck! Oh 
no, I collapsed. Ah, oh, damn it! Are you awake? This is the first time we've spoken outside of your room. We spoke in the lobby of the dorm. Forgot about that? Why are you here? I told you, remember? I'm always with you. Creepy. But we don't have much time to talk. Tonight, there is more than one ordeal you must face. You should hurry. She's waiting for you. You guys will need her. See you. I hope we meet again. Dick. Are you alright? It's too hot. I can't get any backup. I'm sorry. Find us and go with the other. I don't wanna! <laughs> Devil man! Thank you. 
more money for this than I did grinding all those floors last time. about you sorry I don't think we should enter Tartarus this way again oh yeah did you hear a voice on your way here yeah kind of like who's there are you human like that it, that's it that's the voice wait didn't that come from behind us You Fuka Yamagishi? Yes. Wow, you're alive! That's awesome! Never fear, the heroes are here. Good to see you're okay. Come with us. Thank you so much. I you good? Y yes, I'll be fine. Sorry, I'm just so relieved. Looks like I made the right call then. I'll see if I can contact Mitsuru. What is this place? One second I was at school, and then... Uh, it's kind of a long story. We can explain after we get out of here. Mitsuru, can you hear me? Mm, no good. All I hear is static. Oh. Are you hurt anywhere? You've probably seen the monsters wandering around, right? So, there is something dangerous in here then. I've gotten by without them finding me so far. Wait, you've avoided them this entire time? How is that possible? Um, it's hard to describe, but I can sort of tell where they are. What do you mean? Are you saying you're psychic or something? She has the same power as Mitsuru, actually. She might be even stronger. Mitsuru's persona is always more combat-focused to begin with. Persona? Hang on to this. If anything goes sideways, blow your brains out. <gasps> Wait, is this... is this a gun? Think of it as a lucky charm. It doesn't actually fire bullets. Um... Okay. All right, let's get out of here. Oh, check out the moon. It's huge. I don't think I've ever seen it so bright. There's some research that indicates the shadows are affected by the phases of the moon. Although the same thing is true about humans. That would explain Yucatan's mood swings. Hey, wasn't it a full moon the night we went to the monorail? It was. Uh, is something wrong? Hey, did you see the moon on the night the dorm was attacked back in April? It was full. Today is June 8th. The monorail incident happened on May 9th. 
and the assault in the dorm was on April 9th. They were all on a full moon. Mitsuru, are you there? Hey, can you hear me? Mitsuru, come in! Mitsuru? Mitsuru! What is that? It's much bigger than the others. And it's attacking someone! Damn it! What the hell's going on? Totally lost here! It's one of them. If my guess is right. They come every full moon. We've gotta hurry! Hey! Wait for me! Hello. There's two of them? Mitsuru! Takeba! <sighs> What's going on? Nothing's working! Zanata-san! Gotta draw the shadows away! Yeah, I'm on it. Hey, if it's a fight you want, then you've got it! Akihiko, be careful. Normal attacks don't work on them. And there's this asshole. Uh, Luca. No, what are you doing here? Moriyama son? Hey, come back! Please get out of here! It's not safe! I. I had to tell you. I'm sorry. That's not gonna protect anyone! What are you doing? Oh, I thought I was gonna die there, but this is much cooler! Yamagishi-san? A persona? I can see... I... I can see these monsters' weaknesses. Can it be? Just as I thought. Mitsuru, let her take your place. We'll handle these guys. I'll begin searching for the monster's weaknesses. Please give me some time. Just checking. Go, oh, fuck. It's done. I can start the analysis at any time. Please tell me when to activate it. Uh, next turn. Ready 
It's over. Luca, you... Are you okay? Yeah. Oh, thank goodness. Luca! It's all right. She's just exhausted. Luca, Luca, I... Where did those two shadows come from? Somewhere outside of Tartarus. Just like with the dorm and the monorail. Outside, huh? Uh, what are we gonna do about Moriyama-san? She knows about the Dark Hour and the shadows. It doesn't matter. She's not like us, so she won't remember anything that happens in the Dark Hour. Oh, good convenient. News is she didn't fall victim to the shadows despite hearing their call. So I don't think she'll get drawn in again. She's safe now. But doesn't that mean she'll forget Yamagishi-san saved her life? That doesn't seem right. Actually, I get the feeling that things will work out. I'm sorry, Fuka. I'm so sorry. It looks like she's learned her lesson. I'm sorry! <laughs> Huzzah. Boo. Boo. Yay. Good. Good morning. Precisely. Yeah. 
after a boss fight. Yeah, let's see what the next couple of days hold. Another rabbit's foot? That poor rabbit. All right. Chug, 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 chug. Just gonna sneak back into practice. You ditched? No way! I had a legit reason. Like? I was at the hospital. My mom insisted. I shouldn't have told her about my knee. She made the appointment without telling me, so there was nothing I could do. Well, that sucks. You said it. I don't get why my mom and the rest of the team are acting like this. It's exhausting having everyone up in your business. Today they took some x-rays. They'll give me the results in a few days. Not sure why that has to take so long. Oh, hey. Don't tell anyone about me going to the hospital, right? I'm counting on you. I feel bad for always asking you to keep things quiet. Sorry about that. Appreciates me hiding his shame. All right. The doctor told me to take it easy today, but we should still get to practice. Oh, wait. If you're leaving, that means practice is already over. Well, guess I'll just go home. See ya. Money. Hey. <laughs> Fine. Not happy about it. <laughs> Fortunately, that's pretty much the money I made in Tartarus anyway. By the way. What do you got? Wanna... Sure. It's a deal. All done here? 
Весенняя. <laughs> he really wants to get up to the 1500s. What? doing the social links because it always makes me hungry. <laughs> that enough appetizers? Excuse me, sir. Two bowls of the usual today. And as always, make sure one of them is extra large. Coming right up. But the sodium intake... Taste this, my friend. There is no going back. Ton, ton, ton noodles. Yes, that's three. Count them three tons. This is the crown jewel of the secret menu here. Even better than the Hagakure bowl. The simple salt based broth, complemented by the rich, spicy miso sauce. It's like a microcosm of the miracle of creation. Secret. Eh, whatever. The harder I think about it, the hungrier I'm gonna get. Oh, sir! Don't toss out that first bowl, all right? That soup and I have unfinished business. This is a huge honor for you, you know? You're only the second person to taste this after me. Don't forget to blow on the noodles to cool them off. with me and just so you know you wouldn't be getting this with my younger brother because the gourmet king's brother is not the gourmet king so do you get me hmm who am i go on i want to hear it come out of your mouth the gourmet king my word not so loud are you trying to embarrass me here, have some of my boiled egg. I had a couple of bites, but it's still good. Uh, no 
more talking. The food's gonna be a chewy, flavorless mess if we don't eat up. Sir? Sir? You saved that first bowl, right? Because I'm gonna be needing it. Sharp Edge knows no fear! times. Back from the hospital. You remember what we talked about last time? Nothing gets past you, eh? It was a day ago. So, yeah. I just got back from the hospital. They had the results from my last exam. And, well, I... Ah! You gotta be kidding! Why can't I stand up? Lean on me Thanks. when you're not strong, and I'll be there. Funny, huh? All from just crouching down to tie my shoes. The thing you were around. If it were anyone else, then the rest of the team would have found out. Oh, Thanks, I already man. told them. Really grateful to have you as a friend. train by myself. Even if practice is over, can't skip out on training. Big Meat's not that far off. You're heading home, right? Then we'll train together next time. Take it easy. So, you're Fukuyama Gishiku, right? Y yes Relax, there's no need to be nervous. Go on and have a seat. Uh, okay. I just want to quickly mention that everyone did an excellent job uncovering the truth. Ah, and one other thing to report. I've heard that all three girls have regained consciousness. That's great news. From what I understand, they each came to the school around midnight and waited for the security guard to leave. Then, once the dark hour began, they were attacked by shadows near the gate. Because of the situation's similarities to an old ghost story, rumors naturally spread quickly. I knew right from the beginning that it wasn't a ghost. It's all my fault. 
What? Where'd you get that from? You were the victim in all this. But all of those rumors started because I was absent for so long. That's totally not your fault. I don't think we could have won that fight if you hadn't been there. You saved our lives. That's not something just anyone could have done. Take pride in that. You have a special power that you can use to help others. A special power? We call it Persona. And right now, our group absolutely needs your abilities. Can we count on you to help us? Are you asking me to join you? You get a gun. That's right. Kirijo-senpai. We won't force you to, but we'll make you feel really bad, so we're essentially forcing you. <sighs> I think you'd make a good addition to the team, too. Sanada-senpai. You know we're not trying to pressure you, so if you need some time to think about it... I'll do it. It would be my honor. What? Are you sure? If you do join, you'll have to move into the dorm. That's fine. I'd rather live here than at home anyway. Thank you. We really appreciate this. We'll have the school talk to your parents to resolve any issues. Okay. Thank you. Wait a minute. Aren't we dragging her into this a bit fast? Um, it's okay. Stop looking to really? give horse in the mouth. One other topic I'd like to discuss is those special shadows. We had another encounter this month. While we still don't know where they're coming from, I do believe Sonata-kun is right. They seem to appear alongside the full moon. This, at least, will help us plan for the future. So, the next full moon is showtime, huh? Knowing when to expect them is a big advantage for us. Now, on the day of the fight, We'll be ready to get in the ring. Five tries? Mr. Okoda's in hot water. Really? What'd he do? Your mom? I don't know, but I think it's serious. Sexual harassment, maybe? No, that's <laughs> next game. I can totally or see that. Game after next. Um, good morning. <sighs> hey, look! It's the ghost girl! Quiet, she can hear you! Luka, you're here. Moriyama-san? I heard you started living in the dorms. Yes. 
You're looking glum today, as usual. Well, if you got something on your mind, you can always talk to me. You could probably use a friend, huh? Moriyama-san. Come on, you don't gotta be so stiff. Just call me Natsuki. Thank you. How many times do I have to explain it? It's like I'm talking to a moron. Oh boy, here we go. Why would you even accuse me? The cigarette butt was in the boys' bathroom, right? Then can you prove it wasn't a girl who brought it and left it there? Proof of a negative. With that logic, this is never gonna end. I'm done with this. You're on your own. Neanderthals. Yeah, they're the worst. And by they, I mean you. Try not to hold it against them. They think like children. They just can't help it. Sooner or later, they'll see the light. Then I'll earn their trust, and they'll learn to respect me. Is that what this is about? I don't mean to isolate myself. I'm just remaining detached. Someone always gets hurt in any relationship sooner or later. I suppose I've gone on long enough. I, I apologize. Aha. Uh -huh. No point in having a meeting today if no one else is here. Let's go. check to make sure that uh there's actually worth doing any more courage what's a level above fearless though clearly there seems to be a level six circle but if i'm without fear how much more courage can i get oh, not again yet again I want to sleep, mysterious boy. You remember what I said before about everything coming to an end? Well, I recalled something else. I'm pretty sure the end is unavoidable. But it's kind of weird. It doesn't feel that inevitable right now, considering the vast potential inside you. Plus, I don't like you calling that. It seems like your powers changed quite a bit. Hey, if you don't mind. Can I be your friend? I'm really curious about you. What do you say? If you stop waking me up in the middle of the night, fine! Okay. Then as of right now, we're friends. My name is... Pharaohs. I know we'll get along great. Creepy. Well, okay. 
am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast established a new bond. Thou shalt have our blessing when thou choosest to create a persona of the death archive. Yay! Social link go? Well, it's getting late, so I'm going now. I can hardly wait until the next time we meet. Bye-bye. I think I can. Every time he leaves, I smell a gas leak. Good morning. Yay! Yes. I know this is sudden, but the chairman will be coming by again this evening. I'd like everyone to gather at the usual place tonight. He just came by the other day. Something happened? Apparently, he's prepared some special gifts for us. I know it'll be busy with Yamagishi moving into the dorm, but I'd appreciate it if you could all come by. Special? Does that mean we can expect something good? I don't know. This is Ikutsuki-san we're talking about. He's probably just gonna tell us some new joke he made up. Then had written down for a whole week. The dark. Danger. You don't look so good. Are you sick? Yes. I'm surprised you could tell. Huh? You really are sick? <laughs> no, I was kidding. You're so easy, Maiko. No fair, I trusted you. Don't tease me just because I'm a kid. And who are you? I'm Maiko's friend? That feels like a test. Sure. Ah, uh, so you're the one she was talking about. I was wondering what you were like. Do you see yourself as her guardian? Or are you simply two children playing together? Hey! I'm hungry now! I want takoyaki! Takoyaki! You can eat with us too, Stripey! No, I'll pass, thanks. See you later. He's gone. I usually see him around the shrine on Sundays. I pass by on the way to cram school. Okay, it's takoyaki time! I'm still hungry. Oh, it's so hot, I almost burned myself. I remember one time my dad burned his mouth on this stuff because I put too many in his mouth at once. He was like, oh. Dad hasn't been coming home much these days. It's my birthday soon. Do you think you'll come home and see me? I don't want to build you up with false promises, but sure. Mom always gives me presents on my birthday. She hasn't asked me what I want this year yet. Mm. If they really loved me, I wouldn't get a divorce. You're the only one who spends time with me. Oh, I have 
to go home. Today is laundry day. If I don't do laundry, the house gets really messy. See you later, okay? That's a lot of flowers. Yes, come in. I think we should start heading to the command room and... Huh? You already finished unpacking? I was planning on helping you out later, too. Well, I didn't have too much with me, so I finished a lot sooner than I expected. The stereo? Oh, are you good with computers by any chance? You think you could teach me? I'm really not good with stuff like that. Sure, if you'd like me to. Are you looking into something? Yes. I figured I should know everyone's defining characteristics and whatnot to prepare for battle. I can't do any actual fighting, so I need to make myself useful. Oh, I see. You're a really hard worker, Yamagishi-san. And you've got an amazing ability, too. Now that I think about it, Everyone in this dorm is pretty amazing, huh? Sonata-senpai is hands down one of the strongest. And our leader has a power unlike anyone else's. I bet Kirijo-senpai is strong, too. And Junpei... Well, he's... whatever. But what do I have? I'm only half the person everyone else here is. I couldn't even do anything the last full moon. Maybe I don't need to be here after all. <laughs> red flag, red flag. Well. Huh? I was told that a persona is the power of the soul, also known as your other self. That's why I think a person's personality and feelings are reflected in their persona. For example, Takeba-san, your persona has healing powers, right? That's because there's a kindness in you that no one else has. Uh, I'm not kind at all. I just don't want to see anyone go down or get hurt, that's all. <laughs> Come on. I think Akutsuki sounds gonna be here soon. Oh, and you can just call me Yukari. I hope you like it here, Fuka. I'm sure I will. Thank you. It's Yamagishi. Yukari chan. Sorry for calling you all again so soon, but I brought something special today. Well, let me just show you before I get into explaining what it is. Another gun! Oh, I'd like to provide you with some new equipment. After spending quite some time in development, we're now ready for the battle testing phase. The shadows are getting stronger. You just barely won the last battle. June passed the key for you to they'll grow even more powerful still. That's why you all need something more to stay in the fight. From now on, I want everyone to use these during your operations. Combat gear, complete with a matching armband. And your new trump card in the battle against the shadows. Cartridges that enable the use of theurgy. Explain. Theurgy means spiritual magic that could reach the gods in Greek. To put it simply, it synchronizes with the user's emotions, and when the right conditions are met, allows them to unleash an attack of immense power. Oh, you're talking about signature attacks. Oh, yeah. I've been waiting for something like this. Okay, how does it work? Well, about that. It's a bit difficult to explain. I think it might be easier if you just try it out for yourselves. Deal. Hold on. Isn't it dangerous to use something like this without knowing how it works? Oh, don't worry about that. It's been well tested and determined completely safe. By who? Oh, there's a manual for it as well. Take a look at it if you feel the need. Well, I'm sure glad I made it in today. With Yamagishi-kun joining us, Kirijo-kun can go back to being a frontline fighter. That means Seas is going to have a new lineup after today. And what better time than now to roll out this new weapon? Don't you agree? 
Oh, would you look at the time? I'd like to talk more about this, but I've been quite busy with the investigation into those large shadows. I think we're on the verge of a breakthrough, though, so I'll be sure to let you know what we find out soon. Okay, I'm leaving the rest to you, Kirijo-kun. And there he goes. I sort of thought this before, but he's rather laid back, isn't he? More like careless. It's fine. We should just give it a go, like the chairman said. In fact, since everyone's already here, now might be the best opportunity. Let's head into Tartarus and try out our new equipment. I've been wanting to get back into the swing of things anyway. And this will serve as a good test of our team lineup with Yamagishi as backup. How does that sound? Man, this trump card stuff is getting me so pumped up! And like that, like, Junpei, you're the standby member. Super Ace Junpei attack! Or something like that. I'm a little nervous since it's my first time, but I'll follow your lead. Do not say that out of context. Right. We'll go into Tartarus once everyone is geared up. Understood. <laughs> Put your tuxedo back on, Junpei. Great walk in, everybody. Take five. Oh man, this is awesome! We're like a super elite task force. Come on, could you at least wear it like you're supposed to? Oh, but it does look like everyone's outfits are a bit different. Each one is made to complement our physiques and fighting styles. And we're testing the prototype out on me. But it feels even better than it did before. It's very light and sturdy. I wonder if it's the same materials they use in the military, or maybe even the ones for spacesuits. Seems like this armband isn't just for decoration, either. According to the manual, there are a bunch of different features built into it. For example, it can give you a readout of your vitals. Hmm, what else? There's also a function that notifies you when you can use your theurgy? Ow. Sorry, it doesn't look like there's much information about that. Helpful. All I can tell is that you load the cartridge into your evoker to use it. Then let's make that our objective for today. Make sure to stay alert, everyone. All right, Yamagishi, you're going to be our backup, just like I mentioned before. This time, I'll be joining the rest of you in battle. I'm going to. I gotta make sure my skills are still sharp. Me too! Alright, then including our leader, that will be our team. Ha! Uh. Wait, I wanna go too! I was so ready for this! You can't just put me on standby! We can't go without our leader. You stay here and support Yamagishi. Gotta keep our ace in reserve. Really? Idiot. When you put it that way, how can I refuse? Don't worry, Fuka. Nothing's getting past me. Uh, okay. There he goes again. Fuka, if it gets too dangerous, just leave him behind. And don't be afraid to smack him if he tries anything funny. Okay. Got it. Huh? You get it? 
Yamagishi, could you scout the area and find a good floor for us to start on? Okay. It seems different in here from before. Well, that's nothing new, right? No, not like that. It seems distorted. It's probably just temporary. I'll try and find a stable floor for us to start on. You can tell that much already? Wow, Fuka. It could be because we didn't enter the usual way last time. Or because of those huge shadows. We have no idea what's gonna happen in here. Not that I'm complaining, though. All right, let's go. Oh, that new sword looks pretty cool. And this bow I got is really light and looks pretty easy to use. I can't wait to see it in action. So the chairman got us all new weapons too, huh? Guess we should be thanking him. He barely explained anything, though. Sometimes I can't tell if he's actually helpful or not. All of this has been custom made for us. You can tell because of the C's mark engraved on everything. As always, you're in command. And make sure to check the equipment before we get started. Marvelous. I'm looking for... Are you accepting a request? Oh, my. Oh, okay. I will await a report of success. Oh, yes. By all means. Oh, yes. I will await a report of success. <laughs> I will await a report. Oh, yes. I will await a report of. Very well. Yes. Looks like we're here. Yamagishi, do you copy? Yes, I'm here! Are you picking up any shadows? Um, it looks like there's one close by. Be careful! All right, let's head over there and feel things out. Two left! 
This is our chance. That was amazing. Like search in a barrel. There's no escape. Out of my sight. Crushing victory. Yes, mommy. I mean, what? Looks like everything went well. Fuka, you were amazing. Great job. Thank you, Yukari-chan. I still send some enemies nearby. Keep an eye out if you decide to engage them. Oh, we're engaging them, all right. I know. Move to strike. Persona! Yes, only two left. Nice. This is our chance. Now's your chance. Here we come! Now the fairy is the dear right! Out of my sight! Perfect coordination. I no longer detect. It's all coming back to me. It would be wise for me to keep battling. Let's keep going then. Um... Hang on! I'm sensing something on the floor above us! Something strange! Is it some kind of powerful shadow? No, it's... It feels similar to the distortion I felt earlier. Roger. Let's move carefully and assess the situation when we get upstairs. Can't say shit. Huh? What? Why is it all dark? Where did everyone go? Please, everybody, just stay calm. It looks like you were all sent to different locations on this floor. So they separated us by force. There's danger lurking in this darkness. We need to regroup as soon as possible. Yamagishi, can you guide us? Now, do not make this a common thing. That seems really annoying. Uh, why now? Fuka, where should I go if I want to... <gasps> Yukari-chan, look out! Huh? Gooey!
Oh, hello. It's a tooth fortress! Times. Yukari chan Fuka, I need you to back me up. I'll hold this thing off until everyone else gets here. Take this! Head on! Let's go again. Let's go again. Thanks, but you shouldn't be so reckless. Takeba, later. Looks like you both are okay. Sorry I worried everyone. It's all right. You did well in handling an unexpected situation. <sighs> Maybe we should consider starting over. Let's head back to the entrance for now. Oh, I want to do my thing. Damn it. Good work out there, team. I'm sorry. I should have been able to navigate better. You did good. I agree. I'm convinced that you're the one we need on support. Yeah, thanks a lot, Fuka. I didn't do anything. It was all you, Yukari-chan. That special attack sure was cool, though, Yukatan. How'd you do it? How? I just focused really hard and thought to myself, I have to do whatever it takes. And while I was thinking that, I kind of felt something surging inside me. The chairman did say the cartridge would synchronize with our emotions. Right. Although... I'm still not entirely sure how it works. From what I could tell, it reacted to Yukari-chan's strong emotions. So this weapon gives the user strength beyond their limits when their emotions are heightened? Uh, I don't really get it. But basically, if we're fired up enough, we can really pop off, right? And thanks to you, Yukari-chan, we have a good idea of how it works. From now on... I should be able to tell when someone can use theirs. Oh, Sparkstar, thank you for the raid. Okay, well, this one's accurate, so... I want to do it! Me too! Me too! Actually, I'm pretty fired up right now. Maybe I can already cook one up. Um, actually, I think it's too dangerous to use here, Junpei-kun. I'll do more research into how the sinking with emotions works later. Everyone has different feelings when they're fighting. So the timing on when they can use these will probably be different, too. I'd like to give it a go myself, but we should call it a day for now. We can't overwork our leader, and we've got some time until the next full moon. I'm a little worried about the change with the floors, though. What if something like that happens again? Yes. If something has changed in the tower, we'll need to be extra careful when exploring from now on. In any case, we may have had some problems, but we learned a lot today. Not only did we get to test our new lineup and equipment, but we also got to see that we're all improving at a remarkable pace. Aw, Kirijo-senpai! Quit buttering me up. Just leave everything to Junpei Iori, the soon-to-be MVP. 
maybe I shouldn't be the one to say this, but you literally didn't do anything today. Wah, wah, wah. The burn was so bad, no one talked on the way back to the dorm. Hello, this is Elizabeth speaking. Block. I'm calling in regard to a recent change in Tartarus. It seems that a path that had been blocked off is now open. I thought it prudent to inform you. Well then, I wish you a safe journey. What, Elizabeth? Fuck off. All right, well, we finally got a new Persona user. We have some new crazy stuff, and Tartarus is open. I think I'm gonna call it there, folks. <laughs> Halfway through June, roughly speaking. Thank y'all for joining me. Uh, we will be back tomorrow with more Baldur's Gate 3 co-op, and then the rest of the week will be a surprise. <laughs> uh, let's see. Fortunately, it looks like Zito is doing some legal company, so I can keep your Monday nights going. If I can open this thing up again. Until tomorrow night, folks. Hope you all stay safe, sane, well-fed. I don't know. All that's good stuff. Just walk, taking down the clock. Oh, there we go. Bye!